Lunchtime, wait's over. That was easy. Totally. I feel like we just had our snack an hour and 17 minutes ago. I never Still working on that afternoon almond? I haven't been sucking on it so long, it's smooth. It's like sea glass. You do you. <gasps> Um, so I've signed up for Muscle Talk with PSA on Saturday next week. So it's Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Today, seven days out. Um, from next competition, uh, I go on Instagram. I reach up to uh, quite often. Convince me to sign up. Uh, thanks, Anna. And I thought I'll use it as a um, extra stage experience and kind of just experience um, and I'm freaking out now I am um, having a bit of an anxiety about it so that's why I'm saying potentially I don't know if I'll do it I'll see how I feel I am a bit um, like conscious about my body, I'm not sure, you know, I don't want to be one like looking like a blob and I know I don't look like a blob but you know, prep brain, hashtag prep brain, you just keep thinking, you know, you're quite fat, etc. Um so I think definitely this year I'm gonna finish the season prepping myself and definitely next year I'm gonna have a coach because especially my thug I one minute I think I'm lean, one minute, another minute I think I'm fat and I just need someone at least to tell me yes you're ready or no you're not etc. Um, so anyway, um, so this last week i um, been again a struggle, it's craving, hungry all the time, um, that's when it's just getting really tough now. But I'm um, just putting long, uh, I only snuck once so that's not bad. Um, and yeah, uh, so obviously if I do that competition next week, that I'm one week out. If not, then I'm six weeks out from two bros, which I'm definitely doing. Uh, so I still got six weeks to lean out, which I need to lean down my legs more because they're holding still um, to a fat. Um, but yeah, I'm quite excited about two bros. I don't know if I'll have the right physique. I'm quite stocky quite big quads so I'll need to obviously change my posing to hide them but we'll see just you know trying different federations how it goes and um yeah
Friday session number two done. Um, uh, I do not recommend doing it when you need a wee. I, um, it, when I got to the gym, it was quite busy. So I was like, okay, I need to jump on this now. So I was trying to be because it would be, um, I won't be able to jump on again. And I'm going to go to the toilet and I'll the longer 30 minutes of my life. I went to Sainsbury's and I got this and it's so good I mean I'm not a big fan of espresso um, just because it's too bitter for me but this is really good so I got it in ice cubes I added some sugar-free liver drops and it's so good it's like 31 calories in 100 mils obviously you could go lower than that if you had normal coffee and espresso but you know, there's almond milk in it and really, really recommend it. Um, I think it's only Sainsbury's that sell this brand, but um, yeah. And also, I went to Waitress yesterday. Hey, Blue! And I got this and it's so delicious. Um, I put a little bit in my omelette, like after I cooked it, just spread a little bit. And it's so good. I mean... You know, it's calorific, but you don't need a lot because it's got, um, it's quite salty. So it literally, it's like quarter of a teaspoon. A teaspoon is like five grams, I think. So it's barely anything, but um, is a game changer. Really, really recommend that to add into your dishes. I might add it into like chicken or something, or I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, really good. Also got this and let me tell you put it on a rice cake or in the porridge is amazing it's so so good it's like actually really quite sweet um macros are not too bad i mean it's got less fat than normal peanut butter because they add you know their cookie dough, dough flavoring and um some protein so i think um but it's really really good like that's gonna be my go-to i think and last thing I got this as well um, so I love shortbread and this is a millionaire shortbread and it smells amazing I've added it into the porridge um, about 20 grams like I usually add it with other protein and it's not really sweet so that was quite disappointing uh, but I had a mug cake yesterday and made it from one scoop so obviously one scoop is like 101 calories and it was amazing dessert. I'm gonna show you later when I have it. Um, what it looks like, so it's quite dense actually. So it's, yeah, I'll be probably getting that um, frequently and having it as a little dessert. Um, just show you um, macros on that. So it's um, in, um, in 25 grams of scoop is 19 grams of protein, which is not bad. So it's actually not too bad. This is the protein I add into my porridge. It's so sweet, like I can add just even 15 grams of it and it's so, so sweet. Like comparing to the other one, it's amazing. Snickerdoodle is like um, a little bit like cinnamony. There is a mix of casein and normal whey, which is, uh, casein is a slow release and whey is a fast release protein. Um, I'll show you uh, macros as well. So 31 grams. Um, it's got 24 grams of protein, um, carbs and fat, same one and a half, but it is so good. Like when you, if you want to have proteins, this is the best protein to add to it. Like seriously recommended.